Hey Google admins, welcome back. This is Goldie again uh, in this uh, video of our Google Frontline Worker SKU series. Uh, let's talk about uh, this scenario where your user whom you assign Frontline Worker license has consumed more than two gigabytes and now that user is stuck because that user can't send or receive emails, can't upload files to Google Drive. What should you do in that case? Personally, I feel that in case if that user is consuming more than two gigabytes, then that user is more towards the content uh, creator role than the content consumer role. So personally, I think it might be a good idea to consider this user uh, for regular Google Workspace license than the frontline one. But still, just in case, because of some reasons, if you still believe this user is a frontline worker and all he needs is just a bit of more storage, then I'll show you two options. Of course, first option is uh, in your mailbox right here, you see this icon which can take you to the drive storage uh, space or under Google Drive, you can click on buy storage here as an end user. When you click, you will come here with, where you can see the details and then you can just click on one of the plans that uh, is applicable to you. For example, if I go with this one, I can put my credit card details and I can purchase this storage. Usually it gets reflected within a few minutes. Okay, now, as an admin, I don't think enabling this individual storage might be a good idea. Ideally, you should be uh, assigning storage as an admin at a central place from your admin console to this users. So let me show you the other, other way, which personally I think might be uh, a better way than individual storage is to uh, first purchase the license of uh, Drive SKU storage and then once you have the license you will scroll down uh, under license assignment and here you will uh, do the license assignment as you see here Google Drive storage license that comes in multiple tiers so you can go ahead and for example assign uh, you know, whichever license you want. For example, let's go to 50 gigabytes in this case, do the assignment, click on save, and then user within a few minutes should be able to, you know, get that reflected. I'll come back here into my email, do a quick refresh. And as you see, it was pretty quick. Uh, I think within a minute it says, instead of two gigabytes, now this user has uh, 52 gigabytes because we just assigned 50 gigabytes and I don't see you can't send or receive email uh, error anymore. I hope this was helpful. Uh, in case if you have any questions, comments or feedback, do not hesitate to put that under this video and I'll be happy to collaborate. With that, thank you so much.